times have called my next guest one of the most important figures in rock music. Like, I need them to tell me that. He just released his first solo, solo album in six years, which is called Black Tie, White Noise. Please welcome David Bowie.
some of the uh, some of the music on the new CD here. You wrote uh, for your for your wedding, is this true? Wrote right it for the wedding. We had a, a, a church marriage in Italy, and uh, in my family are all Muslim. My mine are Church of England, so I had to write a, a kind of a music that both families would feel. It's kind of a Wait, now, little bit city, little bit sand, a so little bit rock and roll. You're Protestant. Yeah. Cheese would be what? Muslim. Muslim, and yeah. you're in Italy, which is a Catholic. Yes. That's real tricky yes. music yes. to write. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah but the, the, we, we, I didn't have a backbeat. There was no funky priest when no. the, the drums and, and the bass came later. Oh, I see. Yeah. Okay. Now, you man, you've been married what? Uh, a year, one year, just a yeah, year. Yeah, just so we just celebrated our first year's anniversary. Oh, that's the exciting. Other So where did you guys meet? How did this all come about? <coughs> a friend of ours uh, introduced us uh, in 1990, um, and we just we had dinner one night, and uh, that was, it's very simple, kind of all, <laughs> well, orthodox. That's like a parent orthodox, thing. Orthodox, yeah, that's like a parent thing. We say, "How did you and dad meet?" Oh, a then, friend introduced us. We had dinner, and, then... us and we got an awfully well, and shared a lot of the same interests and the same subjects. Yeah, it was. Uh, I was naming the children by the end of the meal. Yeah. Really, really. This... So before yeah. dessert, before you even ordered, you had planned. I, I was think. planning on, yeah, at some point we'll get around to breeding no, but I mean, stick insects. Was it like, <laughs> <laughs> was it like, ah, oh, that's it, this is it for me, or did you say to yourself, hmm, this person I looks said, interesting? that's it for us. I mean, just like, like teenage boy stuff. Just going crazy. Yeah, very much so. Okay. Very much so. So just traditional, that traditional marriage with very the wedding traditional, stuff, yeah. yes. Yeah. Kind of family values kind of thing? Family values. Yeah. Definitely. Well, it's the kind of term that one can bandy around because nobody actually knows what it means. But it sounds as though you have a comprehensive take on life, you see. That's it, but it's just great. The, the, David Bowie talking about... In the English press and the tabloids a couple of months ago, they did an article on the American return to family values. And they said that it was epitomized by the long-running comedy show, Married with Children. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Kind of the traditional, traditional tradition. kind of family nuclear unit. So, are you, are you, <laughs> are you going to be touring now? Are you back I to don't doing know it? Why, huh? <laughs> oh, you're me, huh? Are, are you going back to touring now? Are you going to do some touring or what? It's, uh, touring's a bit like sort of a, a musical version of Bill Murray's Groundhog Day. It's, 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 I really not. Uh, you kind of... <laughs> I never thought of it that way. It's a laughing cameraman. <laughs> but you kind of, you wake up and you look at... You're in Dusseldorf or somewhere in Germany, and, you, and you've got the remains of a cheeseburger that you started eating in Boston <laughs> with you. Yeah, that's a rough tour. And I've got a choice of doing that or just sort of snuggling up with Iman watching a movie about a rock band somewhere in Dusseldorf eating a cheeseburger. So you choose so the latter. choose that. Choose the latter. latter. Choose the latter. Yeah. Yeah. But did you always feel that way? Did you, did you love to you? One time the you loved the tour. The first, uh, first, first 35 or 40 years, I really enjoyed touring. Yeah. <laughs> Now I just, now I just shuffle through my old 78s, you know, the putting old out of yeah. <laughs> or watching Jack Benny's show, waiting for one of your magical cameos. Now see, now see, I was teasing the audience, and someone asked me when I first saw you, and I said in 71, and I said I had some old David Boy 78s that I play all the time. <laughs> I've got, I've got little Richard 78s still on specialty. I've got an Elvis, a couple of Elvis 78s. All right, then I've got uh, Buddy Holly. <laughs> I've got two Jackie Wilsons. Two Jackie Wilsons. Yeah. So you're going to take a little break and do another song I'd for us to. again. Okay, this is a CD. All right. Black tie, white noise. David Boyd, you're right back. with Nicky Tower right after this. Once again, and joined by Al B. Shore from the CD Black Tie and White Noise, David Bowie.
My guest, uh, David Bowie. This is the uh, CD, Black Tie, White Noise. I'll be sure. Al, thank you very much. Nice job. Yeah, nice job. Also on the single and on the CD, Nikki Taylor. This is the uh, the calendar. It's, well, it's not really the calendar, but it's what the calendar will look like. Hey, I'll buy one. I'm going to buy one of these? Hey, well, this is mine. And you, no, you can't have one of mine. Oh, you have one of it. Keanu, the Much Ado About Nothing opens everywhere. And we have to go riding. But a motorcyclist and rider. Keanu Reeves, and uh, tomorrow night, Cindy Crawford will be here, ladies and gentlemen. Cindy Crawford, Fred Savage, and the music of Regina Bell. The Complete Car Cost Guide study.